Hey yo, Carl here from Valorat. Beautiful snowy winter's day. We're gonna look at some gear management. So obviously it's snowing, so changing lenses, handling your gear, you really need to be consciously thinking about this moisture falling. It's super easy just to fold the bag over and feel like it's closed. Always keep it closed, fully zipped up. And then it doesn't matter what happens on the bag, kicking some snow onto it as you walk around, tripping over it, or if you're shooting snowboarding or skiing, there's some snow spray that can come in. Your gear is protected. Changing lenses. How I manage this is you always keep your camera pointed down. Get the lens you want to change, get it ready to change, sort of unscrew the lid but keep it on. And you're going to screw that one off, do a real quick change so you're really just minimizing any effect of anything falling into your gear. And you're off again. I always like to use the lens hood. Now the snow is falling, it's not going to hit the front element and we're not going to get water spots and other spots getting in the way of our shots. Um, keep that a little bit closed while the snow is falling here. And then as you're walking around, as you're taking your photos, just keep your camera pointed down when you're not in use. Definitely don't want to be pointing it up and, and destroying and always wiping that lens. I always carry a lot of lens cloths. I kind of carry a few. Uh, our Valorat one actually, for the microfiber for wiping the front element um, and then a bit of a heavier towel style cloth to wipe down all the moisture um, as it starts getting and melting on your camera so kind of the two cloths there and I carry a bunch so you, if they get wet you just change them out. Another really good thing to have in here are the silica bags. You just save these, them if you buy something. Uh, if you, they usually come in things to keep the packages dry so chuck them throughout your bag and that's another great way to, to keep the moisture away too because you, you're inevitably going to get a bit of moisture in here as it's snowing, as you're opening and closing your bag. So um, those silica little bags are fantastic. Some other tips here for winter photography and managing gear. Batteries. The cold kills your batteries, so keep them in a pocket, in your jacket, close to your body, preferably on the inside. Uh, just keep them warm and they're going to last longer. I also carry a multi-tool always, screwdriver, pliers, um, be prepared to change anything or fix anything on the go, and uh, duct tape. Little roll of duct tape, I just wrapped it around a plastic SD card cover, um, so I got some duct tape to use. This is, always comes in handy for anything, for covering like maybe a, a cable, for, I don't know, if you can't fix it with duct tape, you probably can't fix it. And then lastly, when we go inside, we're going to not take all the gear straight inside, near, near a heater, somewhere warm, uh, it'll fog up, it's chances that there's condensation going to build on the inside of your lenses on your camera. So we leave it at the front door, inside, just in the hallway where it's not too warm and it can slowly acclimatize. Or if we're going in just for a short break, then we leave it outside and then you have to, don't have to worry about the gear uh, changing from hot to cold and back again. So that's it. Tips for keeping your gear good. Good management tips there uh, for winter photography. It sucks when you open your bag and it's full of snow and the lenses are, are, are misted up and all that carry on. So some simple tips just to make sure your images are clean and your gear is well looked after. I'm Carl from Valorat. Check us out on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, at Valorat, uh, and photographygloves.com. Thanks for watching. Ciao.